Hey guys, it's Christina coming at you with an Uber video today. And I'm getting ready to go drive. I'm going to take you guys along with me on my day as an Uber driver so that you guys can actually see what it is that Uber drivers do. Well, maybe not all Uber drivers, so this is just my experience and what I do as an Uber driver. A few questions people had asked me, they were mainly all related to the same thing, so I'm going to just sum them all up. Can you make money with Uber? Yes. Can you make good money with Uber? Yes. I'm speaking about Atlanta because this is where I make money. I don't know about everywhere else, but I do know New York. There is definitely a lot of money in New York. But anyway, I'm going to be speaking about Atlanta right now. So I do Uber full time, about 8 to 10 hours a day. I set aside time to do Uber. Sometimes I will do Uber in the morning and then during the afternoon I'll stop and then I'll come back later on that night. Um, sometimes I'll do it straight through. Um, it just all depends on how I feel. I have total control of my time. So I treat Uber like my business. I don't treat it like a job because the way you would treat Uber is going to determine the way you get paid. So I treat business like a, I treat Uber like a business so I can get paid like a boss. There are people on a low end, like when you want to work, like when you're doing it for about six to eight hours a day, you're going to make at least five to seven hundred dollars a week. Now, there are people that are making fifteen to three thousand dollars a week doing Uber. Now, those people are the business minded people. Those are the go getters. Those are the hustlers. Not saying that the ones that are making five hundred to seven hundred dollars a week are not the go getters and hustlers because they put in that time also. There are different ways to make money in Uber, not just by driving. There are other um, sources of income to be made in uber now once you tap into that you can be banking more than three thousand um, dollars a week you know what i mean like just from being in the house not even not even stepping foot in your car so that's where i'm trying to get i've been doing uber for two months and i'm really studying and learning the business part of it and um yeah so i'm really trying to tap into all the sources of incomes that can be made and I'm gonna take full advantage of that but right now I'm only gonna speak about the driving part making money from driving uber now I'm gonna just show you guys a quick uh, just for one day because I don't want you guys to think I'm lying about what I'm saying so I'm gonna just show you one day of earnings. I'm gonna show you last week um, just one day I'm gonna pick I'm gonna pick this Thursday just so you guys can see what a a day would look like and this is going to be an eight hour shift so for this time that i was on i was time online eight hours as you can see and the fares that i made fares is 138 dollars and 17 cent there was a surge um it was a surging hours and i made thirty dollars in surge and uber took out 42.26 out of the fee so i came i came home with a hundred and twenty six dollars and sixty eight cents and that's eight hours of driving that was 13 trips i completed so i only did 13 trips and i made 126 dollars and 68 cents uber takes out 20 percent of your fares when you're doing uber x i'm also talking about uber x and um i also do deliveries the uber eats i do both so whenever i'm not picking up passengers i'm dropping off deliveries and you can make because people ask me do i make more money doing deliveries or more money dropping off passengers and to be honest it's the same thing the most i've ever made delivering um delivering food to someone was $15 so my fare was $15 not including the tip I got when I got to the door and tips are another way to make money I'm actually about to go spend my tip money on some snacks for the day I made um, $24 in tips yesterday it's right here in case you don't believe me let me count it this one passenger gave me $10 <laughs> um, Anyway, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 
17, 18, 19, 20, 21, $21. That's a 24, I'm sorry. $21. I think I actually, yeah, no, because I did make more, but I ended up buying a energy drink last night because I was starting to feel tired. But anyway, back to this. Um, just an example of a surge trip, because some people are probably wondering what a surge is when the time, um, the whatever, okay, so here you go. So for this trip, I made $39.56 $39 for this one trip that took me 51 minutes. This was a, a, a trip to the airport and there was traffic. So the fare would have normally been $21. However, the surge was the extra $30 and Uber took out 13. So I came with this, $39.56. So that's an example of a surge. And I'm gonna show you guys a picture of what surge looks like. Uh, I took a picture of the morning shift because the morning times, the surge is crazy. So this is an example of the surge in the morning. I took this picture at 7.45 a.m. And that those red marks, surge can be anywhere between 1.1 times higher to 1.6 times higher than the regular fare. So all those dark, dark, dark reds, that's up there in the 1.5. I mean 1.6. Those are like the highest surge. And the lighter ones are lower down in the scale. So it's a lot of money out there to be made with Uber. So how does it work, you're wondering, right? Let me show you guys how simple it is. Because when I first started, I didn't have anybody to tell me you know what to do how to get it now. I just have to figure it out so here it is all right so when you're driving uber you want to have one of these phone holders these little clip things that you can put up on your phone on um, the car because you want your phone to be in front of you in an area that you're able to see it it should never be in your hand it should never be down low where you have to lower your head you just want to be able to move your, your eyes to the screen quickly and back onto the road so this is very 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 important and if you want to be a five-star driver you definitely need to have that you need to make sure you have a phone charger because using the app will definitely kill your batteries now I'm not really too good with the um, camera and lowering it and so that this is darker but I hope you guys get the idea so this is the app and you see I'm offline right now simply just turn that over and I will you know go online I have to get gas so I'm not going to turn it on because when I turn it on I'm most likely going to get a ping but um it's surging right in this area and these red things right here there's a boost there's a boost going on the price has boost so that's what that is right there so I was asked what kind of music do I play for my passengers. Um, right here in the corner they have a little button where you can click and that connects to Pandora. If you already have a Pandora account you can easily connect your Pandora to it. Your Pandora account or you can create one. This is today's hip hop and pop hits. This one is Celia Cruz Radio. I played that when I'm Spanish, when I get I get a lot of Spanish customers that come in here, so I'll play that for them, and they just be, you know, enjoying their ride. I have J Cole, I have Lauren Hill, and I have um, today's hits radio. So I usually just work with those. Mainly, mainly I don't use this one too much. I mainly use these right here. All right, so I just turned the app on, and look, I got a delivery. Click that. Now it's going to tell me to navigate. Hold on guys, I'm driving so I got to turn off the camera and then I'm going to hit the navigate and then I'm going to put it back on. So guys, it's just going to simply navigate me to the restaurant and I'll show you guys when I get there and what's the next step. Okay, so I'm here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go inside, pick up the order, I'm going to click on here, I'm going to give them the order number and confirm the order all right guys so I got the order and I put it in my uber bag 
I already confirmed it inside. So all you gotta do is press after you confirm it, next. And then start delivery, and then you just slide it across, and then it's gonna start delivery, and it's gonna direct you. It's gonna direct you to the person's house. All right guys, so I just dropped the food off. It's no longer in the bag. And I got a tip. So now what I gotta do is, I have to, I was trying to show you guys, so I didn't do it over there. I confirm. I had got her name, so I'm saving it, and then the trip is complete. And then I'm going to rate the trip. Boom. And that's it. And it's that simple, guys. That's all to it. This is gonna go in the tip box. Oh, you give me four dollar tip. See, one, two, three, four. Four dollars in tip. Now I gotta go pick up James. If y'all noticing the time, y'all see how fast I'm getting these alerts. And I just recently turned the app on. So guys, I wanna quickly show you. My last ride was 1760. Eight. That's what I got after Uber took out their um their twenty percent. Damn. I wish I knew how to fix this. But you can kind of see what I'm showing you. I'm trying to drive at the same time, which is unsafe. And I just finished delivering uh, somewhere else. And they gave me a ten dollar tip. It's another tip for the day. This place is real fancy. I'm gonna show you a better view of the, a better look at the view. Before my phone die, let me go. Let me hurry up so y'all can see. This is my third trip, y'all. So, and these tips are not including um, my fares. So that's already $14 in tips. That's gas money right there. That's snack money right there. You know what I mean? So is there money to be made with Uber? Absolutely. Absolutely.